show you how to make a vegan birthday cake protein shake. This is going to be so delicious. I'm really excited to show you guys this. So not only is this going to be a birthday cake protein shake, but I'm also going to show you guys how to make vegan whipped cream and it is so delicious. You guys are going to love this. So if you guys are new to my channel, then be sure to hit the subscribe button. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you guys like birthday cake anything because I'm obsessed with birthday cake flavors of like anything. Like anything could literally be birthday cake and I'm going to love it. <laughs> so if you guys want to see how to make this, then just keep watching. Okay, so first we're going to start off with the whipped cream. So for this, you guys will be needing this coconut milk. It's going to come in a can and pretty much um, you can find it at the grocery store. They should have it like in the health food section of the grocery store. What you guys are going to want to do is put this in the refrigerator the night before. Um, if you guys are wanting to make this like right now, then you guys can just throw this into the freezer for a few hours. So as you guys can see, this is what it's going to look like. It's very hard. But um, once you refrigerate it, there's also going to be this other liquid part. Let me like throw this into a bowl so you guys can see what it looks like. This is what it's going to look like. And you basically, the reason why we wanted to refrigerate it is to separate the two. You guys can keep the liquid and like add it to smoothies or something like that. But for the whipped cream, we just need the top section. But to this, I'm also going to be adding in one teaspoon of vanilla. Now we can take a mixer and we're just going to blend this together until it looks like whipped cream. So as you guys can see, it's super thick and it looks just like whipped cream. So we can just put this to the side and now we're going to work on our shake. For our protein shake, what I'm going to add into my blender, and this blender I got from Target, it was like $14. It was so, I just spilled the milk, but it was so cheap. Anyway, um, I'm going to be adding in one cup of almond milk. Next, I'm going to be adding in half a cup of frozen bananas. My favorite part about this is we're going to be adding in half a teaspoon of almond extract and I'm obsessed with almond extract the way I just smelled it. Like if something smells like almond extract, I just like die because it smells so good. Um, I can smell it like all day. Next what you guys will need is a vanilla protein powder. Um, obviously make sure it's a vegan one. They sell these at Target. Um, once again, like Target has everything. Um, so I'm just gonna put the lid on and we're gonna blend this up. Now that our shake is done, um, if you guys want, you can add like sprinkles into the actual shake. I'm trying to keep it as healthy as possible so I'm not adding in extra sugar, but of course we're gonna put it on the top of the shake because we gotta make it look cute. So now I'm just gonna pour the shake into here. Now I'm gonna put the whipped cream on top of the shake. So now I'm just going to take some sprinkles and sprinkle it on top because we can't have a birthday cake without sprinkles and you guys can probably hear Wilbur barking in the background. <laughs> Last but not least, I'm just going to add in a straw and our drink is done. Just a tip, make sure the protein powder that you guys are going to be using besides making sure it's vegan. Also make sure you guys like it first because if you guys don't like the protein powder you're using, you most likely won't like the drink. So make sure you find one that is really delicious. Like I said, um, Target has one. I think it was called Vega or something like that. I don't know. I'll put it in the description box if I can find it. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, then please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!